Hi, I'm Gary Colabono. I, I've been a dealer since 1975. I've been a senior advisor to the Comic Book Price Guide uh, since 1985. I've been appraising collections uh, for 40 years. Homer had a lot of very hard to find rare books in his collection. Now rare meaning um, not very common in, our, in the hobby. Books that uh, collectors are looking for today, it's the period of time that they're from. They, the books from this period just don't turn up. His, his collection had a lot of uh, war comics from the early 50s, late 40s, early 50s. Some superhero comics from that same period of time, which are very scarce. Many of these are on every collector's list. The first is the Action Comics number 58 from 1943. Um, it was a, a war book. It was a propaganda book where Superman is uh, selling war bonds and war stamps. Another one is the second appearance of Batwoman in Batman 105. Uh, it's the first time Batwoman shows up in the Batman title. She originally showed up in Detective number 233, which Homer also had in his collection. So he had the first two Batwoman appearances. There's also the first appearance of the Human Torch, Captain America, and, um, and the Submariner in Young Men number 24. Distribution of comic books in the late 40s and early 50s was really sporadic around the country. Um, there was a pop psychologist at the time, Dr. Frederick Wortham, who published a whole series of articles and then actually wrote a book called The Seduction of the Innocent, uh, which blamed all of juvenile delinquency and all of society's evils on comic books. There were comic book burnings. The fact that Homer has all of these books from this period of time just make them more desirable. The comics have probably doubled to tripled in the last seven years. Um, due to the fact that the war comics now are much more collectible than they were at that point. So to have, you know, Homer's books hit the market today, my estimate would be on the low end, $50,000, but probably more in the quarter of a million dollar range. American Greed Mondays, premiere episodes 10 Eastern, CNBC, get yours. Hey CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you'll find videos from all your favorite CNBC shows. Be sure to subscribe by clicking right here. Click on the videos around me and watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.